Alright, hey guys, um, I'm gonna just, uh, make a short video about what uh, recording software I use. Uh, I've got a couple questions about it and uh, the codec I use for it. That's a very important part. Alright, so just go to Google, type in Cam Studio. That's the first one right here. And uh, it may not look like you, could, uh, you can download it. Just go, go all the way to the right here. It's about the middle of the page. This is Cam Studio 2.0 EX. Just click on that and run it. I've already downloaded it, so I'm just going to cancel out of that. Uh, and once you've downloaded it, it should look a little something like this. Right here. Alright. Uh, and um, my codec. Just type in DivX. First one says featured DivX.com. On the right here, uh, DivX 7 for Windows. Um, don't buy the full version. It's no different at all. Alright, so just uh, click it. It'll uh, just press run, go through all the steps real quick. It's real quick, so should be pretty easy. All right now, I'm going to show you the settings I use for Cam Studio. I'll just open up a new one. All right, go to video options. I uh, just uh, the set keyframes 36, 27, 36. The auto adjust should be on. Uh, I, once you've done all this, should be DivX 6.8.5 codec two logical CPUs. Let's go to configure. Uh, it'll be set as I think a home theater profile. Go down to 1080 HD profile so that you can uh, upload your videos on YouTube in HD. Sh um, make this one pass and the bit rate. This is where a lot of people mess up. Uh, it's, uh, it usually starts at 600. Put it to 794.467 Kbytes per second. This is t uh, that is what I use. It's no lag at all. Perfect quality. These should all be the same. Just pause it if you needed to look at it or you messed it up. So yeah, that is pretty much it. I'm recording right now. Uh, if you wanted to see how I uh, you get the highlighting option, just uh, go down to cursor options. Just uh, use a highlight cursor. That's how I'm highlighting it right now. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Alright, thanks guys.